Hi, I'm George Shuley with the Squim Valley Lions. I've been a lion for 20 years. Probably the best part of being a lion is community service. Uh, we love to do events like this. We're here sitting in the logging show beer garden. We'll raise uh, probably four or five thousand dollars this weekend, which we turn right around and give to all the local charities, Boys and Girls Club, Habitat for Humanity. Uh, we give away uh, two Peninsula College scholarships every year with the money. Uh, and I think it's just, it's nice that we do a lot of things for the community, like building wheelchair ramps, uh, helping the elderly. Oh, this is great. Freedom! <laughs> and especially doing eyeglasses and eyeglass recycling. Uh, we're real heavy into that. And uh, it's nice to know that we can recycle those glasses and get them to people who really need them. Hi, my name is David Blakesley and I'm a member of the Squim Valley Lions. I've been a member for r roughly about eight years. Uh, lionism to me has just been a great experience and probably experience for the rest of my life. Um, we're, we're like a big family. We just have a great time with our activities. Uh, we do a lot of activities in town. Uh, we have a coloring contest that we do downtown with the kids. And the purpose of that is to have the kids slow down to talk to us so we can talk to the parents about joining the club. The biggest thing for me with lionism is, is meeting a great people that all think the same and, uh, and we're just making the community a better place. Squim is just, uh, people can't believe how many festivals we have each year and how much fun it is. So that's, that's what we enjoy. Port Angeles Lions Club. I've been a member since 1968, so 50 years. Uh, I'm proud to be a lion. And I've served as club president, secretary, most every position except treasurer. They didn't trust me with the money, but uh, I've been a zone chairman, district governor, uh, council chairman for the Mullet District also. What is your favorite part about being a lion? My favorite part would be favorite part about being a Lions member is, uh, is the camaraderie. I think the people, the folks that we're with all the time. Uh, and and it's, it's great to, uh, uh, to go out and work with people and it's fun uh, that you're, you're having fun with the people that you're doing it with. But the best part about it is the people that you're helping. Uh, to see their smile on their face or to see the gratitude that they have, that is uh, it makes it all worthwhile. I'm going to ask you one more question. Um, if you could get a, put a message out about Lions Club, what would you want your message to be? I think my message to, to those that might see this uh, is, if you have a heart for service, um, Lions could be for you. We have an amazing amount of work that needs to be done. There's a lot of activities, service activities that we can do. Uh, and, and we enjoy doing them, otherwise we wouldn't be here. But, but if you have a heart for service, please join us. We'd love to have you. I'm Jackie Larson. I am a Port Angeles Lions Club member for seven years. And I live here in Port Angeles. And a lot of my family is already Lions, so it was natural that I would join. <laughs> Being a lion is, I think, kind of a conscious effort of giving back, and that's kind of how I feel. My husband passed away a few, seven years ago, and so I really needed to have something to do. And because he was a volunteer fireman for almost 30-some years, I decided it was now time for me to give some feedback to my community. And so that's what I really enjoy, is that I'm helping people in my own community. It's one of those things that just give you pleasure to see somebody's smiling face when you've done something nice for them. So that's, that's kind of the heart of the thing. Okay. Um, the breakfast is held, uh, we usually do ours the second Sunday of every month and we're helping the Crescent Bay Lions Club out with that 
because they're very short-handed and they've only got sometimes only three people there to feed a lot of people. And so we took that on as a club to help them out. And it's not only become uh, a service project for them, but it also has been a service for us because we've met so many kind people out there. We know them all now. They know us and it's kind of a give-give situation and we really enjoy the breakfast and we usually have a band there so people can come out and listen, listen to the music, have a wonderful breakfast and it's kind of something that we can help another community out with which we really enjoy.